Hey everybody, I'm going to show you how to make some really cool cases. This, uh, this tablet case I use for my uh, sewing machine heads and also a tablet case for my tablet. I have a dog food bag. Alright, so it's so easy to make, it's just unreal. What you're going to need is a Beneful. You're going to need a Beneful uh, dog food bag and I'll show you how to do that. It's so easy to do. Now with all of my bags, I wash them in uh, soapy water. There's soapy water that I use for my animal feed bags. Now Beneful bags, are, are most of them are taped on the bottom. So you got to remove that tape. And uh, you don't want rip to uh, rip the material. So you want to uh, get something to rip the tape off. Okay, or if you get it just a starting area, you can just peel that tape back. And you can work from both sides. Just grab that tape and rip it. Rip the tape and open up the bag. You want to open it up all the way through. Okay, and you want to have the Ziploc open also on the bottom. So uh, have that Ziploc, get it in there, get it all wet, wash it, and make sure it's dry. So, all right, there it is hanging on the fence. So it's drying. It's got three uh, clothespins up on top, two in the bottom holding it to the fence, and three on the outside holding the, the lip on the bottom, the opening open so the air will flow through. All right, now after it's dry, you make sure there's no bugs in it and stuff like that, bring it indoors. Uh, what you're going to need is a uh, uh, clear uh, boxing tape. Okay, it's the same kind of tape you ripped off from the bottom. You're going to need a pair of scissors also. So I have a pair of scissors standing by. All right, this is my tablet. It's an HP uh, uh, spe Spectrum, I think it is. That's what it says on it, at least. It's a really nice one. All right, if this one fits just like this into the into the top. All right, now yours might sit, sit sideways. There's also this much room, and it expands out like this. All right, so you have a lot of room for other things in there. But what you want to do is have it up on top, just keep this closed. Now pick this up and uh, let it fall down to the bottom, to, or actually to the top. You know, uh, what you're going to do is uh, grab it, and you know, what I do is I add about three fingers. Okay. So three fingers up, all right, and that's that's where the curl is. There's going to be two curls on this. We're going to cut it here, tape it, and then curl it up one more, all right, to be up like that. So this is where the cutting point is. It's going to be right below where it says 100 com uh, compliance. So what I'm going to do is with it in there, go as straight as across as I can, and cut straight across. Right below that that line, you want to keep it as as uh, straight as possible, and you can uh, run the scissors across. All right, there you go. I'll be using this for other stuff too. All right, so now what I do is I take two two or three pieces of this. Okay, I'm going to put it on my on my wrist. All right, just have it have it uh, set. Just going to take some hair off, put it under the under part of my wrist with less hair. Okay. You want to do that because this is going to be our holding tape for the first. All right, so we're going to take this, roll it, and roll it again. This is what they do in the in the factory on the bottom. They're just emulating what, or simulating what they're doing. All right, now it's going to try bouncing back. This is why you need the tape. So I'm going to put the tape, uh, what you might say, horizontally. That way, the one that goes over it's not going to affect it too much. Put one over there, one in the center. These are just holding it into place. It does not hurt coming off my skin, so don't worry about that. All right. And one over here. Okay, if you do get it on the bottom side, you're just going to curl it across. Okay, that that holds it into place. Now what we want to do is we want to go over the edges. Take this over the edge, about an inch. All right. And we're going to bring this all the way across pushing it down as we're going. Alright, and all the way across. Cut it. Alright, pick it up and wrap it around. This is exactly what they do with the original one. And that's it guys. We now have tablet. Now when you have this in, a, in an airport or wherever, who's ever going to even think that this is your tablet? Who's ever going to think this is your purse? Enough room in there for your power cords, your USB, some documentation if you want to bring it, lots of room inside there, open it up, and voila, there it is. And how much did it cost? Think of that. How much did it cost?
somebody in your family, your friends, have dog food bags like this. So another crafty idea from Quinn's Recycle Products. Subscribe and see a whole lot more helpful videos. Bye now.